Angie, hey, we're gonna learn it from Angie. Ah, uh, she's a robot from Sweet. We're gonna learn it from Angie. That's me. Welcome to Engineering Expo. Well, what are you waiting for? Let's go. Hi everyone, my name is Vivian and I'm a Lobby Security Specialist with Fidelity Bank. Hi, I'm Diana and I'm a 7th grade student. And today we'll be teaching you how to create your own lava lamp and using the experiment to explain the concept of density. Density is a measurement that compares an amount of matter an object has to its volume. For example, if you put an object in water and it floats, it is less dense than the water. And if the object sinks, it is more dense than the liquid that you put it in. So now we're gonna teach you how to create your own lava lamp and test out that theory. So for today's experiment, we will be using vegetable oil, water, food color, seltzer tabs, and string. Okay, so to start off, we will be starting with about one fourth of the bottle filled with water. And now we will be adding about eight to 10 drops of food coloring into the water bottle. And after putting the food coloring into the bottle, we will now be using a stirring stick to mix that together. And we will be adding the vegetable oil, leaving at least one fourth of space. As you can see, the oil and the water are not mixing. This is due to the oil and water having different densities. In this case, the oil has less density than the water. Now we're, now we're adding the tabs and um, just break them in half and then add them. And this is after a few seconds. So as you can see, the water and the oil never mix. That's due to them both having different densities. Once we put the tablet in, it sunk right through the oil with no reaction. Once it finally reached the bottom and touched the water, it reacted by releasing carbon dioxide bubbles. Once they finally reached the surface, they popped, creating the lava lamp effect. Thank you for watching and make sure you check out more content at wichitaengineeringexpo.org. Thank you. Bye. Thanks for joining us today. See you next time.